Hello Jelly Babes, welcome back to my channel. So thank you so much for coming and checking out this design. So you obviously want to start off and prep your nails ready for a gel manicure and this is the um, magnetic polish that I used called Galactic Mist. So you are going to need to apply a black gel base first and cure that and then you want to put the magnetic polish over the top. Um, but you don't obviously want to cure it until you've got your magnet and place that over the top so you just want to hold it there for about 10 seconds just so it gives time for the polish to move around and then you're left with this gorgeous sort of gold streak which I've kind of used to kind of like represent the sky like I said this was inspired by LD Nails XO over on Instagram this was the design that she created and I just fell in love instantly so I just wanted to recreate it. So I started off and I used these tree images off uh, this DRK season stamping plate and I was just going to kind of, I started off just doing it plain black at first. You'll explain, you'll know why I'm like pointing this out later on because <laughs> I didn't do all the rest of the nails like this because I came across something stunning sort of accidentally. So what I'm going to do is get these Divine by Natasha Lee glitters. This one is so, so pretty. It's got lots of colours that come through because obviously it's um, an iridescent and it's called Unicorn Essence. And I'm actually going to be sort of like spreading it onto my clear stamper because it's like really fine. I'm able to do this. So it's almost like putting a powder on top of the stamper. So this is basically like stamping with glitter, which is just always going to look gorgeous. And then I took these um, sort of line of um, tree images here. Obviously, got the stamping over with the glitter. And you obviously want to work quite fast because it can dry. And I know it looks a little bit of a hot mess right now, but it won't do. Because once you've sort of left it, I'd say like you know 30 seconds to a minute just to make sure the stamping polish is dry so it's not smudged you know give it a good vigorous rub with a nail brush and it'll just get rid of that um excess polish i did just clean up that uh, white stamping excess just with some acetone and then when i applied the top coats I realized basically how absolutely stunning this looked over the black. You can just see it peeking through there. And I was just like, I've so got to do that on other nails. And so that's what I did. But obviously this was top coated and cured. So I didn't, um, you know, I couldn't sort of do that nail again. But I don't really, really think it matters in the grand scheme of things. <laughs> So obviously I'm doing the same process, just rubbing it into the clear stamper. How I get the glitter off, the excess glitter off the stamper is with a lint roller. You don't want to be putting any harsh chemicals on your stamper. But if you do find that it's not sort of sticking as well as it has done, you might need to get some um, isopropyl alcohol and just give it a quick wipe just to help, you know, clean the glitter, clear the stamper off. So I've got this image here and obviously I've used the black stamping polish. Now you can't really see the colours, you won't really see that that well until you apply the top coat. And then it kind of just brings it to life. So just look at that colour. And then I did obviously the white stamping trees that I used before over the top of this as well. But that just looks so, so pretty. And I love the flash of like the magnetic polish as well. It's proper like, you know, a forest at night kind of look. And then I just wanted to finish it off with some star designs. So this was Bundle Munster. It's now called um, Manology, is it? Or something like Hello Manology or something like that. But this was when it was, you know, back when it was called Bundle Munster. So that's how I finished it off. Just adding like the few uh, stars that you can see here and this is the end result which I just absolutely love jelly babes and I really hope that you love it too if you recreate this tag me in on instagram at jellylicious I would love to see your recreations let me know uh, what you think about this money as well and also the new technique of stamping
So please give this video a thumbs up, press subscribe if you've not already done so, and take care and I'll see you in the next one.